There's nothing more fun than picking out new glasses, and all of the frames here are from GlassesUSA.com. They have over 2,500 frames starting at $48, and with so much to choose from, I want to give you my favorite tips to find the best frames for your face shape. So whether you're round, square, or oval, we'll find the best frames for you. So let's start off with a round shape face. This is as wide as it is long with a soft jawline and forehead. You want to choose square frames. So just think round face, square frames. A straight line across the top and sides. This will sharpen up your features, add a little bit more shape and dimension while counteracting the natural softness of your features. But you just want to make sure to avoid anything that's too rounded especially oversized round glasses, as this will just add to the roundness of your face and it won't be as flattering as a square. Now, if you have a soft jawline and forehead, but your face is longer than it is wide, then you have an oblong or a long shape face. Similar to a round shape face, you wanna choose frames with a square or sharper edge. Try to go for a broader top line. This will add a horizontal line to broaden out the face and add some more balance. And as you have a long face and more space to play with, your frames can come a little bit lower onto the cheeks. And this will once again add some balance to your face shape. You want to avoid small, narrow frames, particularly round ones, as this won't complement or flatter your face shape. Now, if you have a square forehead and a square jawline, and your face is as wide as it is long, then you have a square shaped face. You want to choose more rounded frames. This will add an elegant softness to your square shaped face. Similar to how a round shaped face went for a square to sharpen up their features, square shaped faces want to soften theirs with a rounder curved frame. You guys can see we have a little bit of a theme going here. Avoid matching your face shape. So stay away from overly square shaped frames as they just emphasize a square jaw and a square forehead, which isn't too flattering. For our elongated squares or a rectangular shaped face, you want to choose oversized round glasses. You have a lot more room to play with, similar to a long shaped face, so your glasses can sit a little bit lower onto the cheeks and add a nice curved shape to the face. This will soften out any harsh features and give you elegant softer features. And once again, avoid anything too similar to your face shape, like small, narrow, rectangular frames, as they're not as flattering as the softer curved ones. Now for those with a heart-shaped or a triangular-shaped face, you need to watch out for the top line of the frames. To complement your rounded forehead on the heart-shaped faces or a jawline of the triangular-shaped faces, this needs to be a little bit broader. Make sure it's slightly wider for heart-shaped faces or wider than your jawline for triangular-shaped faces. And this will just add more balance to your face. The great thing about being a rectangle or a triangle is that you can play around with your frames. Vintage frames in particular look great on your face shape. The only thing to avoid are large, oversized frames. So go for daintier frames instead. For my oval-shaped girls, you can choose whatever style you want. Everything works for you. So you're lucky enough to play around with as many different styles as you'd like. The only frames you want to avoid are oval shaped. Otherwise, you can choose whatever you like. And if you're still a little bit unsure about your glasses, go to glassesusa.com. You can actually upload a picture of yourself onto the website. Click the type of style that you want to try on and see what they look like on your face. They actually sponsored the glasses for this video, so a huge thank you to them for helping me create this video. I'll put more information all about that in the description box, and I will see you guys in a video really soon.